So with the French Open six weeks away, the entry list has come out for the event and very interesting to see the entry list with all the protected ranking players coming into the event. We're starting with the men first, so let's have a look at who is actually playing and who is actually going to be seated at this stage before the event. Of course, the seeding does change once we get towards the event, but at the moment, that is the top 32 seeds and the players that are just outside that 32 that over the next few weeks will try and get in. You've got players obviously like Djokovic, Sinner and Alcaraz, the big three there, will be trying to go for that top spot. Other players that are in the seeds at the moment, you've got players like Rude and City Pass, obviously played really well last week in Monte Carlo. A little bit further down, you've got some good clay quarters there like Baez, Jarry, and Echeverry. They're in the seeds. And then the players that are just outside the seeds for now, you've got players like Ogier Asim, Monfils, that might be seeded by the time we get to the French in a few weeks' time. Going further down the list, you can see there Andy Murray. He is on the entry list, which is good to see despite being injured over the last few weeks. You've also got Vilch in there as well, who of course beat Mevedev famously in the first round last year at the event. Stan Wawrinka, of course, he is on the entry list as well. So we'll be watching out, see where he is in the draw when the draw comes out in a few months. And you've also got Berrettini there, just sneaking into the main draw. But here are the protected ranking players that are already in the event. So you've got Nadal, gets a protected ranking, of course. Chilich, Shapovalov, Nishikori, and Kwan all getting in because they've been injured over the last few months. So those players are gonna be floating around the draw for a possible first round match against one of those top names. So very dangerous there. And the players that just missed out on the cut and that will be playing qualifiers unless they get a wild card, Dominic Team and Richard Gasquet being the two big ones there, not playing the event unless they qualify or unless they get a wild card. You'd expect Gasquet will get a wild card. He'll probably get the French wild card. And Team will probably get one because he has been a finalist here a few times before. But there are some really interesting qualifier, potential qualifiers there as well. So there you have it. That is the entry list for the French Open. No big names missing at this stage. Of course, the closer we get to the event, the more withdrawals we have. Uh, there are players there that are injured currently, like I mentioned with Murray. Tommy Paul's another one who's got an injury at the moment. He is expected to play at this stage, but it is six weeks away, so no one's making any massive decisions yet. And of course, Rafa Nadal being an unseeded player at the French Open for the first time in ever. I mean, maybe 2005 when he first played, but that's going to be really weird to see. But let me know down the comments below. Out of all that list, who are you most excited to see at the French Open? Of course, I'm sure Rafa is a popular answer there, but there are other players that are going to be playing the French Open that might have skipped last year, or some players that you're excited to see maybe do well at the French Open this year. Someone like an Alcaraz, or maybe even Sinner, seeing that last year didn't do too well. But there is the entry list for the men's French Open, six weeks away until the event starts.